Uh, in Rockbox, I'm a clinical analyst and I work in the clinical chemistry R&D department. Um, so I'm involved in the development of new reagents and also involved in the improvement of existing reagents. Other things um, involved would be transferring existing products onto new platforms, uh, but also deal with the troubleshooting of customer and product queries should there be any problems out in the field. A reagent is a chemical used to detect another chemical or an analyte in a patient sample. Um, so a cholesterol reagent, as the name suggests, uh, detects cholesterol. So that means that the end user, such as a GP, can look at the results and determine whether or not they're too high or too low um, in relation to what the normal range you know, should be. It's very important indeed um, because Everybody's going to take ill at some stage of their life. Um, I'm going to take ill, you're going to take ill. Um, for example, something like diabetes, um, we have to constantly monitor the levels of glucose, and then a GP can administer the correct dose of insulin. Um, I mean, it's only when you can establish what the problem is that a suitable therapy you know, can be given for a particular disease. Um, for example, something like diabetes, it's caused by the fluctuation in glucose levels. Um, and that's controlled by insulin. So, as well as the diagnostic reagents being there um, in order to determine what the problem is, they're also um, a good marker of how the therapy is working. Um, for example, even chemotherapy can have adverse effects on our vital organs. So, it's important that um, the reagents are there to kind of monitor the health of those organs to make sure there's no fluctuations in any of our analytes within our blood. Uh, there's several products actually. Um, I kind of like the old school of products like glucose, LP and cholesterol. They're the main things as part of a panel that would still be tested in um, our blood samples when the GP takes our, our blood. Um, and it's a reflection of the health for vital organs such as our heart, liver, kidneys, pancreas. But also like the new generation of reagents such as the DOAs, drugs of abuse, things like cocaine, um, phetamines, cannabinoids because Drug use is very detrimental to the person who's abusing them and also in society. Um, so it's pretty important that there's assays like that available for testing um, patient samples so that illegal substances can be detected and that can only be good for society and for upholding the law.